All right, welcome everyone. We're Semblance of Sanity. I'm Brief. And I'm Godabill. <laughs> and we're here to see a panty and stocking, uh, maybe, uh, well, possibly. Maybe that's what you're here to see. Yeah, that's not what I'm here to see. <laughs> I'm possibly here to see panty without her panties. <laughs> You want to talk about it in the confessional? I really don't anymore. I'm kind of scared of that place now. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, uh, yeah, Panty and Stocking with Garter Bells, episode 11. Yeah. Yeah. This yeah. intro is very brief, so uh, without oh. further ado, let's get into it. Yes, yes. Uh, Once upon a time in Garterbell. Once upon a time in Hollywood? Who be in Disney? Well, ah, the show is coming to an end. We need you to hmm, start taking the plot seriously. The wind in the background. <laughs> The power of 2D. Mm-hmm. All right, you devil worshiper. What's your story? Oh, yeah, they're coming for my ass. <laughs> coming. We entered a Dark Souls level. Yep. Oh my god. Mm-hmm. We're gonna have a proper Gynax ending. <laughs> what? Yep. <laughs> the Vitruvian um, uh, Guardian statue, yes. Did that thing kind of look like an angel? Like, um... Kinda? Like Ava, Ava Angel? My history. A long time ago, I grew up in a shithole, so my choices were limited. Garter was a badass? How come he's a walking vagina now? Oh shit. This is hardcore. Yep. Without me, you wouldn't have a goddamn penny to your goddamn worthless name, you punk. No one's gonna tie me down. Wow. Yep. Power, you name it. I had everything I ever wanted. <laughs> oh my god. I made a deal. <laughs> yeah, right. Oh, yeah, right. I should be in hell and I damn well know. <laughs> <laughs> Let me tell you something, God, or whatever your name is. I don't give a fuck who you are. I do what I want. Oh, oh, oh shit. <laughs> and that's how he got the afro. He was sent back in time? <laughs> He's immortal. He yep. can't die. Oh my gosh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. And then a flood. Nice, yeah. nice. Uh huh. This is incredible. Fuck you, God. I'm gonna yeah. live my life my way. <laughs> oh my gosh. It wasn't to keep you out. It was oh to keep my me gosh. In. <laughs> I've seen it all.
<laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. Holy shit. What? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <sighs> that was amazing. <laughs> uh. Mm. Uh, food. Mm -hmm. Real food. Oh, delivery? I bet that fucking Afro tank liquor is trying to starve us to death. Carter, why don't you hurry the fuck up for Christ's sake? If we die out here, we're gonna kill you. Patience is a virtue. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> I love the text popping up. <laughs> it's his food. That's Chuck's food. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> the whole plot yep. has been derailed. Mm hmm. He's fisting stockings whole. You yep. Know. Yes. Ah, such. Which is fine if they're nice, but I don't like Aspergers with extra ass. Hmm. Oh, and while I was doing it, he told me that. Get this. I was better than his mom. What kind of fucked up shit is that? I forgot about that. All in the same room. Yep. Mm hmm. Holy Mary, Mother of Almost. <laughs> you want to order pizza? We can do that? Uh huh. Sorry to keep you waiting. 
Oh no. <clears throat> oh no. I, Gardebelt, have the pleasure to announce that the Association of Afro Brothers has chosen my Afro as the world's most beautiful. Stay <laughs> <laughs> up and enjoy the party. Myself, I'm more packing exhausted. I'm going to bed. Good night, everyone. Oh, and one more thing. Waste not what not, you fucking hoe. <laughs> Fuck you! Like, that was what Chuck yeah. said! Yeah. He got translated! Hi, I'm with Pop Pop Pass, and I have a shot head snack attack. I'm with Hot and Steady Bakery, and I have a. Well, pretty much the whole bakery. Well, they did what he said. Yep. Why am I not gonna leave it? Oh, sweet boy, where are you when I need you? Oh my god. God, this this skit. Oh my god. Yeah. <clears throat> they just took the same yeah. background and everything and then just uh -huh. animated them in it and yep. then eventually just overlaid some stuff onto it. And then just let the voice actors go wild, basically. Mm -hmm. We got right. to one of my favorite Ugh. swears in this show. Well, fuck you very much. <laughs> I I I loved this episode. It gave us um, a very real insight into Garter Belt. Mm. Yes, which I was impressed by. They gave us a genuinely serious story here, mm -hmm. for the most part. <laughs> right. For for as for far as the show belt. is concerned, well, and, for Garter Belt and especially. Garter Belt. Yeah. So mm -hmm. it's the oh, is there something weird going on here with him? Well, I mean, yes, yes many things. But... There's many things, but we didn't actually get into the stuff that's probably the most relevant, which is presently what he's doing. But I mean, we saw what he occupies himself with with regards to, yes, making himself have uh, a good time. Mm -hmm. But there's not really much more to say about that other than that. It is, nope. an, it is an interesting thing to think about the idea that he is potentially in league with God or whatever on some kind of mission, which is interesting, but we didn't get into that, so there we go. You know, that's, that's how he became that. a priest. You know, there you go. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He, he had a bit of a thing for uh, cocaine, I guess, back in the day. Oh, you know? just that. No, no. Yeah. And My man was things. the picture, the embodiment of sin. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> and then the, it was the cursed fact. with immortality, so and, that he would go and live throughout yep. all of human history and from the, fact, the dinosaurs. And, to and he now. got the afro by being struck by lightning, smote by God, indeed. Smote by God, yeah, indeed. Mm -hmm. um, incredibly silly first skit here, but I I love the unhingedness of the second one in that it is in that it's just basically the voice actors mm -hmm. going off at each other. Yep, with just constant obscenities and. And just absurdity. It's it's something where I feel like they're oh, like over it. the course of the show that's we've had show. Y yes definitely yeah. but like we've had some very we've had a lot of variety with the skits right mm -hmm. it, you know all over the place from yep. you know yep. every True. every direction and which way and all that right mm -hmm. but I feel like one of the one of the things that is showcased by this skit is that yes it's all about that dialogue right yeah because we can have the crazy action and we can have the crazy animation situations and, situations, and animation yeah. and all that stuff mm -hmm. but really it's about these characters just just going off at each other going off at each other yeah right and we had that this episode and that was entirely that was the, the episode. En entirety of that skit there was yeah. nothing else to it yeah and it was delightful I, I love the idea of the off-screen comedy yeah. of the miscommunication of wh wh what's Garter doing. Mm -hmm. Who knows? Apparently, yep. he's making food. Right. Sure. Okay. Mm -hmm. Why? So the girls get progressively more and more bitchy and more and yep. more annoyed and more and more frustrated and more and more hungry to the point where their mood turns this whole freaking skit into a shit post of the of epic proportions. Yep. So, yes. Mm -hmm. More of that. That is that is so funny. And the fact that doesn't this show have a second season planned and being made like right now? Somehow, yeah. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah. Yeah. If we get more of this, wouldn't I, that be delightful? I, I, I am so delight. I am. I am kind of curious though. If 
if slash when the you know second season happens, we get the dub for the second season. <laughs> you know, they'll probably want to bring back the original voice actors and stuff for uh, continuity if they can, because it is a delightful. I don't dub. think all of them will come back. They well, might I not think, be able to get I all of them. I think the but, main ones will. But the, yeah, they'll they'll try and I'm sure they'll try and get them if they can. Probably at least panty and stocking. Yes, but yeah, assuming <laughs> they do. <laughs> will, will we still get will we still get this, this? level of degeneracy yeah, like, who knows man who knows Asperger's with extra ass I, I can't yeah, yeah. there's so many yeah. lines that I'm like I don't want to repeat that out loud mm-hmm. like I, I just don't yep. I don't need the sound bite of me nope, saying that nope, shit nope like, <laughs> and, and I'm already regretting the fact that I yeah <laughs> it's, it's just this yeah. is the kind of like abridged just mm-hmm. nonsense where you're like Oh wait, no. This is the actual just show. Yep. This is it. Yep. It's it's yeah. Mm-hmm. It's insane. Um, yeah. Yeah. I, I couldn't. I, I I really couldn't with the uh, with the way in which Panny and Stocking kind of carried a conversation, yet it felt entirely improv. Right. So like, if you let him like, <laughs> you didn't let him penetrate yet. What are you talking about? Yeah, I well, kind of wish know. I'd let him finger me a At little least, bit. Though. Yeah. Does that make you feel better? Yeah, a little bit. And it's like, what, what, no way someone is just like, mm-hmm, this yeah. is the script for this right. episode. Like, bitch, I'd take a, what was it? I'd take a cooked, <laughs> I'd take a cooked wiener yeah, over, over a, a fresh over one. Over a right. fresh one. Do you know what that, like what that means for me? <laughs> oh. Uh, Oh my God! Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's painful. It's painful. Yeah. Yeah. Like. Yeah. Stalking. And and Panty have this like it feels weird saying it backwards, but like but like, they each have their own very unique ways of responding to things. Of course, yes. they're different characters, but there are times where they meld into a single brain organ, <laughs> yeah. like single celled organism, and it's just. <laughs> This is the result of that. Right. This is where you can believe that they're siblings. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. Like, exactly. There's so much about them that's entirely different that mm-hmm. I, I really like because then it creates some natural conflict. But this is the kind of shit where they're just like, eh, we're suffering together. Might yep. as well make the most of it. Uh-huh. And complain and bitch together. <laughs> right. You know? Stalking being like, oh, I'm getting so hungry that I'm turning emo. <laughs> gonna start cutting like like when she said i was like no no you can't just no that's uh." oh no i like that i joked writing poetry i like that i joked about them like ah they're gonna do delivery then it took them like 10 minutes to realize wait we can do delivery i was like you fucking idiots that's not what you were waiting for this entire time i thought that's what was going on in the beginning yeah. Like, I've been there, I've been there, where the delivery person is like literally like mm-hmm. 45 minutes late because yeah, there's and then they shit that goes down and then they cancel. Or even yeah. if they actually do show up, then it's like the whole thing of their like, hey, sorry, the food's a little cold. Here you go. And okay. I'm like... Oh. <laughs> Refund the order with the place yeah, there right, and right. make another order immediately. Mm-hmm. And then it's the, well, I guess I'm just going to put this in the fridge, you know, and... Save yep. it for later and they try and get a refund with the the, the, the it's restaurant. It's a TV meal at that point. Yeah, exactly. Like, yeah. You're heating something up a second time that probably won't be the same consistency or texture the second time. No. Or taste as good at all. Yeah. Yeah. Oh boy. Uh huh. Oh boy. It really felt especially like kind of I don't know emotionally resonant uh-huh. because it was also the ah uh, I remember. Like COVID and <laughs> right, yeah, <laughs> just the, sitting the, in a room. This episode, like, they're they're it's all in the one room, here? right? And then yeah, COVID. It's the well. Oh God, I'm in this room. This is this is this, this is, is my life now. now. Yeah. Yep. Went yep. a little mad. Went a little insane. Yeah, I yelled mm-hmm. at the TV maybe a little bit, or I guess I wasn't really watching TV. I was more watching TV on my computer. But but yeah, the point still stands. Yep. But yeah, there was mm-hmm. that very clear like isolation equals madness kind of thing going for them. But at least they had each other. To, at least they had each other. To, to, misery loves company. Right, and it didn't become, okay, we start to hate each other because we're stuck right. together, right? They, uh-huh. they, they were unified. They were. Right? Yeah. They were equally suffering. Yep. There were different things that they were craving, but, you know. Exactly. Different. They took out their frustrations on Chuck and Garter Belt, you know. And poor, poor brief like yeah brief, <laughs> yeah brief is kind of an idiot but like mm-hmm. he 
he genuinely was just wanting to hang out with them. Right. And when he's trying to make form connection over the over the TV show, okay, well, it's, it's stalking and she's like, I don't care. I don't to be know fair, who these he are. was the um actually no, no, like definitely. twice. No, no, yes, yes. That and, killed and, all of his charm. Yes. All of his no, charm. No, but the one time he might have actually been able to like say something and have it be appreciated. Mm -hmm. Maybe. Um, yeah, no, Panty already left. I also just love the idea of a voice actor coming into the booth after these, have, these two <laughs> girls have been improv for potentially like hours and stuff, and they've collaborated together. Like, once he comes in here, just fucking no butt everything he tries to put in his yep, improv yep, yep. and mm -hmm. character. It'll work even better. And then he'll respond in character with that miserable, like, oh, you know. Okay. Okay, okay all right. All know. right, sorry. I'll it's just go hang out with Garter Bolt, I guess. In this episode. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, I I don't really have anything else to say other than I I kind of wish I kind of wish we had more of this episode mm -hmm. and it was like a part one of two specifically for the garter belt stuff <laughs> so we could have like next episode focus on that more. Um, but hey, yeah, hey, second season, second season. I I still yeah. can't believe that's actually happening. Mm -hmm. Like. It's been 84 years. <laughs> it's 2013, and now we have news of a second season. Two, uh, 2023. We have news of a second season, and this show came out in 2010. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like, does Gyn I don't think Gynax even exists anymore. No, they don't. They don't. No. no. So it's like, all right. Sure. Is it going to be D Trigger? <laughs> like, <laughs> yes. I mean, that's, that's where Amaishi is, so, you know. Uh, yeah, I, I, I mm -hmm. do it. Yeah. So y'all, thank you so much for watching this episode's reaction and discussion. If you want to see the next episode's reaction and discussion right now, though, go check out the link in the description below. For our Patreon, you can get an early access there. You can watch full-length timer reactions there, and all this comes with Discord access, so you can chat with us in the community there about this show, about anime in general, and also be sure to check out our Twitch channel. We stream every weekday. The info's in the description. Yes, if any of that interests you, we'll see you there. But until then, we're Semblance of Sanity. I'm Caleb. I'm Jacob. And we'll see you all next time. time.